What's going on, y'all? It's true. Came back through the double down on this nigga named uh, Marcus. Marcus. For any of y'all that seen that movie, Boomerang. Bring your ass out, bro. You can't bring your ass out because guess what, y'all? In the, in the streets of Memphis, Tennessee, uh, Marcus is nowhere to be found. But then again, Marcus ain't in jail neither. I mean, when well, you know a nigga government name, I'm quite sure y'all been seeing that shit on YouTube a lot. You know what I'm saying? You know, when you know a nigga government name, I was only, only two places. If he ain't in two places, if the nigga ain't in jail, they took him from the scene, and he ain't on the streets. He ain't out of town. When I say the streets, I'm talking about uh, nigga Atlanta, just like uh, down the block and up the street. Y'all know how I ain't no imaginary borders don't stop shit. The streets are the streets connected from the from from the from the streets to the penitentiary. That's what all y'all that certified. So Marcus ain't nowhere to be found. So let's just speculate for a minute. Where could Marcus be? Because he ain't dead. I mean, he ain't dead. So if a nigga that the police MPD took from the crime scene ain't on the streets, I mean, not out of town, the streets, ain't in jail, oh, where, oh, where could little Marcus be? He got that name right. I think I heard somebody say that nigga name was Demon. He got that motherfucker shit right, nigga. You, you, what, I mean, <laughs> what's higher than a goddamn Demon? Y'all got to top what this nigga did to his brother, bro. But you know what? You know, that's 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 already certified and verified, uh, you know, that he responsible for this shit. But you know what's cold, though? <clears throat> you know what's really cold? Is that the shit happened at Makita's, right? So if he did that, that would only lead y'all to believe that uh, the cookie shop knew about this shit. Oh, we, we just getting started, too. So... If Marcus ain't dead and he ain't on the streets and he ain't in jail, oh, where, oh, where could fucking the demon Marcus be? Dun, 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 dun. And if he, if he on that dun, 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 if he there, then, oh, we, it's a lot of people in motherfucking trouble. If he on that dun 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 dun, if he there, there's a lot of people shaking in their boots right now. If he there, now where could there be? Let me let me reiterate. Marcus is not on the streets nowhere on earth. Marcus is not in jail nowhere on earth. Marcus is not dead. Dun 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 dun. Marcus. Is the key <clears throat> to this whole goddamn conspiracy. And Marcus has a wealth of knowledge. Marcus must not have been built for this shit. You know how you do some shit? Some of y'all steal a pack of bubble gum and then go to your grandmama's house and then all of a sudden your conscience is killing you. You want to take the gum bag once one Big Mama get on your ass. You want to take the uh, pack of bubble gum bag and say you're sorry, write a note, bring some flowers, and uh, motherfucking side swell up and down. You'll never do it again when Big Mama get on your ass. And now uh, what you think happened to a nigga's conscience, conscience to do some shit like this to their blood, bro? And then, and then get entrapped. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? He got a lot to say. Marcus. So, Makita, I say y'all about to buy the beer at 1030. Now, y'all saying y'all about to buy the beer at 1130. Marcus is a canary. Sing. So, there's some shit brewing. Hopefully we'll get it done. This is the home stretch, people. This is the final piece of the goddamn puzzle. Final piece of the puzzle. Maybe we can get it done true. I ain't gonna say we. When I say we, I'm gonna say me and you know, everybody that support me. Uh, before the anniversary of Dolph's home going. 
Cause ain't nobody dead yet. No, death has death has not even started yet. I'm talking. I don't care if it's Ted Bundy or anybody. Nobody has been judged yet. So death, everybody resting in peace for now. But you know, Marcus has to be going through a whole lot of shit. I wouldn't be surprised if the nigga hang himself or some shit like that. But you know, <laughs> I would for the slip. You know, I doubt if that happened because uh, where, where can Marcus be if he ain't in one of them three places? And uh, let me say this. Also, over the over the uh, course of this investigation and justice for Dolph is what I'm going to call it. Because unlike many of y'all, I actually knew Dolph and shit. This is Memphis, though. So when you, you know, I'm a AD boy. I ain't proud of it or none of that shit. You know, I wish I was selling, you know, I wish I had been in the in the weed game long before that but uh in the conspiracy it's a lot of players and a lot of lot of shit a lot of players you know and uh i'm gonna say this about something i heard a few months ago about some eyewitness i don't know i don't keep i'll be out here in the field and see uh somebody seen something it's a lot of people that seen something but you know Specifically, somebody seen, I think, yeah, quite sure I heard somebody say somebody seen somebody run from Family Dollar to Makita back and forth and all this shit. Well, you know, the names that I heard them, them call, yeah. Oh my God, I just fucked up my whole white tee with this bullshit ass cup. Look at this shit, man. Don't worry about it, I'll buy another one. Fuck, man. Uh, yeah, so who we, since y'all don't know who it really was, where what, what, what the fuck was Marcus at during this time? And were any employees at Makita's that day? In a conspiracy, everything ain't how it appears to be. Because y'all are easily fooled, as I can see, even with the shades on or the shades off. I'm going to take them off so y'all can look into my eyes. I can see, you know what I'm saying? In some circles with, with elderly, they call your belly button your third eye, but that's a different story. Uh, let me also say this. Oh, I ain't finished it. Who the fuck ran? They, I showed y'all the back door. Didn't did y'all see the video? When I watched the Makitas, what the white boy said, what Slick said about that back door and what I asked him. I say, on this particular day, if the back door was left open, then what he say? Oh, the back door was left open. Oh, anybody and their mama can come in. Okay. That's exactly what the fuck happened. Now, who was it? And why didn't... How did Marcus <laughs> shoot at a car and miss it completely? And where was he? Did he go inside the cooking shop with the Draco? Uh, uh, uh. He didn't go outside inside the cooking shop with the Draco. It's a lot of shit that happened on this on this day that's coming out now. So when the streets start talking, oh we, a lot of niggas are already gone. That's why I told y'all don't worry about the shooters. The shooters gonna get clipped in the conspiracy. That's rule number one. You send a do boy to do do the job. Then the dude boy gotta go. Yeah, and mama gonna miss, they mama gonna miss them and they already have. But where is Marcus? And uh, one more thing, in case y'all don't know what true know. Y'all hear shit like Dolph owned over a hundred properties. All this shit true. Uh, properties? Nigga, you talking about properties and businesses? But let me let me let me let me say this right here. Dolph covered his tracks in the game he was playing. Of course, any 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 D boy know you ain't for to push shit in your name. No matter if, if you have legit or all the way legit or whatever, it just it's just a way of life. So yeah, he on the but guess what? Who the fuck? I dare anybody out there that's good at paperwork. And uh, it seems like that's a trendy thing now. Uh, paperwork and see. All right, we're well, fine. This shit. Find out who owned the whole goddamn the uh, laundromat, the whole goddamn building. Uh, remember I, I made a video that went right over y'all head about Family Dollar, Nate Doe? 
which is real key to this whole goddamn shit, right? When you think about it, uh, Family Dollar, Makita's, back doors, the back doors, running in between. When you think about it, why is that Family Dollar? I told y'all that a couple of months ago. Shoom. So y'all support the wrong shit. You know what I'm saying? Well, I ain't got no motherfucking laptop. But then every time I open my mouth for my blood, sweat, and tears, here come, here come trolls and bitch niggas. I don't respect y'all comments. I know them. Back in the days, before I was all heart, like I've been all heart before, when this shit touched home, I was like, uh, respect, respect, respect. You're, you're supposed to respect everybody's opinion. But then when you say blatant ass dumb shit, like this ain't no goddamn business and true results is, is this and that. Bitch nigga, don't worry about if I holler out my cash app tag or not because obviously you a hater and uh, not a not a family member or a supporter. So if you think I ain't got bills to pay, nigga, where the fuck I work at? You see me working at Mickey D? So it don't matter, for, forget my heart. It's still all heart have business with me. And uh see I got a family just like everybody else. So if I spend full if I'm full time investing into this shit, I think I deserve for my people that's rooting for me and, and shout out to everybody that 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 do. You know, despite what motherfucker believe and all this shit, we have persevered all the way to here and now I'm trying to bring it home. No matter what, before November seventeenth, two thousand and twenty-two, when they got the job done in November seventeenth, two thousand and twenty-one, and uh, I got a lot more shit to say. Uh, me or J your ass up next. So if you if you hear what I'm saying on this video, then you 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 could take your ass and go watch the video before this and know the heat is on, and then you go tell the rest of the rest of the co-conspirators what's up with it. And that's a that's a direct message, you know what I'm saying? Because this shit happens all it's on a bigger scale with Dolph, but you know, bitter bitter ass women will get you killed. Dead. Bitter ass, jealous ass women. If you got money, that if, if you ain't have no money then you you've been putting on child support. But when you got money and, and a stature such as Dolph, a bitter ass fucking baby mama will get you taken out the game with a whole lot of niggas that want you out the game anyway. Promises have been made. So everybody profits off of Dolph's death and go find me. Go find me what? Y'all should have fixed y'all own shop up. You see, uh, this whole shit is, is, is so sick and twisted, and it shows you the, the, the level of evil in this fucking world. That all of these people, and there's a multitude of motherfuckers. That's how, that's how strong, shots out, lonely adult, bro. Because what he represented, it took a gang of motherfuckers. It took gang, gang on top of gang, gang, times gang, gang, to take. To, for this one man that represented something so strong with his hustle, his, 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 his message, his blueprint for the South, that they couldn't stand it. But the glue that took him out was jealousy on all levels. Jealousy, like fucking jealousy brought this shit together. Motherfuckers couldn't stand it. All the motherfucking the universe lined up. It's 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 a yin and a yang, and uh, uh the yang got them on on from their side. And uh, trust me, you can already hear. Them. Like I said, uh, I'm M I A J. Your ass up next, cause I know y'all. So I know y'all. I know y'all honey, y'all honey, and money came by that. You know what I'm saying? Money came by. Or hide the evil ass secrets a lot of y'all got. And uh the clock is tick tock, tick tock. Dolph uh got angels. He got he got wings on his back working through people to make sure his kids, his bloodline continues to represent what he represented. And it's gonna come from his son. I seen a picture, I seen the son. 
and he got that look in his eye. The kids know when they when when somebody they love, their father is not here no more. And Doc was uh, excellent, loving father as he was a respectable businessman and man, a philanthropist and nobody can ever death can't take that. He only made him larger than life. I'm for y'all own demise. Now who won? And he's still here because truth still here and y'all still here. Like, share, subscribe, I always fucking support Long Lil Dolph, the king of Memphis, fuck Elvis, and I said it first. Cash out once again for all you haters. Get your ugly asses in the comment section because you obviously you ain't getting on your cash out tag and say true. Uh, man, we appreciate you, you know what I'm saying, from the beginning. And you in the city, you still in the city uh, trying to bring it home. Now I'm trying to bring it home. Let me add to it. Now I'm trying to bring it home all the motherfucking way before November 17th, 2022. You know what I'm saying? Just like y'all couldn't kill a dog, kill me. And I'm going to be still represented because uh, packages, envelopes going out. And uh, test me if you want to. What's my cash out tag and why y'all phones ain't out? Dollar sign, true result number two. Tell the man, man, we appreciate you, bro. We've been watching you. We see you. You want to bring it home before, before the anniversary of, of what they did to your boy? My boy, right? Like, I don't know that, yeah. Okay, yo, what then do what you do, bro? Go ahead, we rooting for you. Boom, here goes something in case they folks come after you. You know what I'm saying? You have to move on it, you know what I'm saying? See, y'all niggas ain't buy me no fucking laptop and then mother was like, true, why you ain't why you can't buy your own laptop? You such a bum. I'm like, bitch, nigga, I do this shit full time with no, I ain't working at Mickey D's, I'm clocking in. So whatever, whatever I get from YouTube and from y'all donations, that's why they call it donation and support. God damn it, stupid motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? My life has changed completely. Life is not the same. Like, you touch on some real shit, you got to be all heart. And I ain't one of them. I, don't, I stopped going live and all this shit once, once. This shit here home. Ever since, ever since then, I've been 10 toes down waiting. And I, I, I've been a silent sufferer. And uh, now the time is sucked. All the motherfucking stars that lined up in the universe, and this is what I, this is why I call myself a man and feel like I'm a man and have been a man for not all my life because you gotta go from a little boy. But uh, y'all should have seen me when I first started and what I was doing. Y'all forgot about my six young niggas, the building. Shout out to TT. You one of the few ones that 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 were you know what I'm saying and know who I who I am. Off, I ain't even on social media. I just came to bring y'all the truth and uh we trying to get it done now so sorry if y'all shaking y'all shouldn't have did this shit to that man y'all shouldn't even did this shit what y'all did it for what, 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 what what's the motive promises that's why makita's blew up so fast after Dolph death promises that let you know the powers that be promises that let you know the 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 bitter uh baby mama promises that let you know the, the young niggas they want to take over promises that let you know the backstabbing brothers promises that let you know what the gofundme was for to pay off the family promises everybody's soul is one man out and he's still a king dollar sign true result <clears throat> true result number two let's get it